Hi Aries, welcome back to my channel. My name's Kim. I'm going to be doing a full moon uh, reading for the 29th of May. And the, this is a full moon in Sagittarius. This moon signifies the blooming of flowers and the variety of flowers that bear their petals um, in May. So it's also known as the corn planting moon and the milk moon. So um, in 2018, you can catch this full moon on May the 29th. It will peak about 3... 19 p.m. and I'm going to put a link below uh, this reading for you to check out if you were born on a full moon um, and it'll tell you a little bit about yourself so I hope you enjoy that. Now I have picked um, three cards from the Animal Tarot deck and three from the Lenormand deck and the, at the bottom of the Lenormand deck um, is the Anchor card and this is um, telling me this uh, reading is based on your career and your long-term uh, plans. Now, the underlying issue is about longing for something. So there's something that you're uh, moving towards or, you, or you're trying to move towards. Um, because we have um, the fox here in the past um, column. And this represents a nine-to-five job. So this is something that you're um, trying to release because we have... The release card, it's a major arcana card, and um, it is significant in this reading. It's the peacock, and it's telling you it's time to release the past and move on to something new. Um, this ending is the first step on the way to a happier future for you. Now, this could be to do with um, uh, trying to move forward and trying to let go of a job that um, is holding you back in doing uh, what you want to do for your long term but um, it's telling you that you just need the confidence to move on it's like a birth and rebirth um, so it's like uh, rising up from the ashes the resurrection of Christ basically and it's telling you that endings can be challenging or they can be exhilarating so it's really what you you do with that and the famous saying whenever God show, uh, closes a door he opens a window so this is applying to you in this situation. Now, um, it's up to you to look for that window when the door is closing. So you may be experiencing um, difficulty at this time, but we've got the universe providing you with opportunities to rejuvenate, bring in that fresh air and grow into something more. So um, your angels will lead you to a more uh, joyful life. It is the ending that has presented itself in something that you've been hoping for. So um, like the end of a career, you no longer enjoy, then you've got to celebrate once you move forward. So that's a nice card from the angels here. But definitely you are longing for this career and uh, you're starting to move towards it, but it's at a very slow pace here, Aries. And we have the king of spring, and this is about you ha being ambitious and wise and having inspiration to do something dramatic. Um, it is a Katanga lion and it's telling you now your, is your moment to step up to the leadership role. Don't back away from the spotlight as your plans will be successful so long as you stay focused upon the big picture. So if you're still stuck in that dead-end job that doesn't serve you anymore and you, you're there for the, uh, the coins basically, um, just know that you are moving slowly towards what you want to do here with the ship and um, it's just out of your reach so once you let go of that negative energy that no longer serves you it opens more doors for you to um, to be able to move forward now in your future position we do have the um, Prince of Order and this is the thoroughbred horse and this horse is very decisive he's very focused on what he wants to do Aries and like all areas, you're very driven and impulsive, uh, definitely describing you. But it's telling you to get ready for progress to speed up. And this situation requires you to choose logic and intellect over your emotions because I know you can be very emotional. You can be very emotional, Aries, and uh, sometimes your emotions um, enter into the factor and you're not thinking logically, but... But it is about you making quick decisions here because you have some uh, communication coming through 
this could be from a distance about a job. So maybe it's a little bit further than where you already go now, but it's definitely going to be something that you enjoy um, because under the anchor card, which is your career and long-term goals, is the ring. And this is about a contract. So I'm feeling it is coming from a woman who's very intelligent. Um, and it's coming from, um, you could get uh, meet this person on the internet or out in public where they can see what you're doing and they like what you're doing. Or maybe this person's been watching you and they want to offer you something. Because under the um, Animal Tarot deck, we have the Major Arcana card, the wheel. And it is about um, you moving forward. So this is quite possible that you're going to um, accept this invitation for a job. And it's going to happen suddenly, but it's going to positively change your life. So you can now move forward with great progress. So you're leaving here um, on the ground here and what no longer serves you. And the wheel's starting to move forward for you and you've got all the abundance in the tree. So all your fruits are, are growing here, Aries. So this is a great um, reading for you for the week of the 29th with the full moon. Um all your seeds that you've planted are starting to grow. But remember, you must release this. Um, I know that you are free to, to move forward. It's just in your thought process. So maybe you're not wanting to move forward because you need that money to keep you going. Maybe you've got a mortgage or you've got loans to pay off and you, you're wondering how you're going to um, feed the family, that type of thing. But you definitely um, have God has something better for you waiting and um, this requires a quick decision for you to make. But it's definitely to do with the job. And maybe some of you will hand your resignation in with this letter here. And you decided to move forward with the ship. Uh, because it's definitely something you're longing for. And this could, um, yeah, just be out of your zip code. Maybe require a little bit longer travel. But I don't think you'll mind because you're very passionate about about this job that's coming for you. So I hope this has been um, a great reading for you, Aries, and I'd be interested to hear after the week plays out how it panned out for you. Take care now. Bye.